everyone. I just left my radiation follow-up um, in Cleveland, so we're on the way home. I've got Mom with me and Reed and Connor. Say hi. Hi. Say hi, Reed. <laughs> Um, anyway, so you guys know that I had that scan on Friday and I don't see Dr. Hamad until tomorrow, but I, the results were kind of posted in my patient portal. So I was able to kind of try to decode those over the weekend and, um, I had my radiation doctor confirm what I thought that there, what I read. Um, and it was all really good news. Um, couple things the lymph nodes that were around the tumor and I say were because they are not enlarged anymore and there was some thickening um, of the tumor like around it through it was like through the fat walls and the thickening it stated had lessened so that's great and absolutely no signs of spread anywhere so long story short um, and good news is that um, it just appears that I my body totally responded to the first phase of treatment and that's awesome praise God so thank you for all of your prayers they worked um, and now we just have to I say we I don't know why I say we it's but I do feel like everyone's on this journey with me um, but no I just have to brave this next leg of treatment and um, everyone asks like are you ready for Wednesday are you ready how do you feel like no of course I'm not ready no one's ever ready to go down but um, you know you you can't finish if you don't start and that's how I'm looking at this so um, I have I have to start number one to get to number eight so that's what I'm going to do. And uh, Cody will be with me on Wednesday, which will be really, really nice. Um, and so, yeah, prayers for Wednesday. And just hopefully it's not too harsh. And um, number one is always the roughest, they say, because you see what your body can tolerate and what it can. So, um, yeah, if you don't hear from me <laughs> for a while, that's because number one took me down. But it's okay. I'll come back up. I always come back up. So um, it was such a great weekend. We had such a positive weekend. Um, we had a, a, a dinner at the Legion with um, a couple biker clubs and just an amazing pep rally as I like to describe it and just, just full of love and support and that was amazing. Those guys are incredible and just such a positive, amazing experience. Um, I say that I've gone, you know, I've had these amazing experiences that I probably wouldn't have had, you know, had I not had this diagnosis. And so it's weird. It's just weird to to have these cool things happening and you see like the good in the world um, in a bad situation. So um, I don't know. It, it's super, who knew such a bad thing could be so positive in other aspects. I'm sorry, Reed is just, he has to have the attention. He's sing, sing for everyone. Just sing, sing for them. They wanna hear you. You want to be heard. <laughs> so anyway, great news today. So thank you for your prayers and keep praying for Wednesday that just everything's okay and, and that I can tolerate this. So um, I love you guys and I will 